Skyler, welcome to Day Today Davis. and thank you so much for clicking on this video. So today I'm really excited because we are having our second annual vision board party today. I got some treats and some food and stuff back here for us and all of my guests have arrived, minus a few who will be here in spirit because they were unable to attend, but that is okay. So um, right now we're getting ready to play our first game and it is the two truths and a lie. I have played it with you guys back during Vlogmas and I thought it would be a fun game for us to play here together as um, kind of like an icebreaker because I always like to do little icebreakers. So everyone's going to go ahead and write down their two truths and a lie. I'm going to participate because I wanted it to be at least four so I'm going to participate in it too and it's going to be hard because my sister is here. So I have to make it like really, really hard so that she doesn't get it. And then we have V from Vena Supernova as well as Chelsea from The Two Become One. I'll have all their channels listed down below so you can check them out. They make wonderful, wonderful, wonderful videos and you guys can definitely benefit from them, okay? Okay, so for this game, I had everyone write down three things. There are two truths and a lie and then pass it to the person next to them to read out loud so that, you know, sometimes when you read, your face kind of tells on you. So we're going to have the next person read it and then we're going to um, guess which one's the truth and the lie. Who wants to go first? I do because I think I know. Okay. Okay. Hers reads, I have a six-month-old baby. I drive a blue Honda Accord. And then the third one's I like to drink wine. I think... The blue Honda Accord is the lie? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'll go. Um, number one, my first language was Spanish. Two, I helped build a fashion empire. Three, I'm an owner of a beauty bar. My first language was Spanish. Nope. Oh. Wow. Ooh. <laughs> one more um, guess. Um, I helped build a fashion empire. Nope. I was like, <laughs> oh, so what was the lie? I don't own a beauty bar. I don't own a beauty bar. <laughs> but I helped build a fashion empire. There's a franchise called Slayers in the city that we live in, and I helped. I seen that. <laughs> Where did I see Slayers at? <laughs> I, did I see that when we were in Orlando? I don't know. I seen, I seen Slayers. Well, good for you. Good job. <laughs> All right, Kendall. This one was hard for me. Yeah. <laughs> it was hard for me too because I didn't even know. <laughs> Okay, number one, I played number four on my high school basketball team. I went to my first plane ride at the age of 27. Wait, read them one, two, and three. The first, <laughs> second, and third. Two. Okay. Number three is I have been to Bahamas twice. Okay, I so. Say. Wait, y'all understood which ones was one, two, and three? That was the best one. The best one was Bahamas. Bahamas. No, she's she, plane. The plane was yeah, number two. Okay. At 27. Yeah. Okay. I think it's the Bahamas twice. Nope. That is true. Oh, really? So then you're the number one then. Because I know you are playing right at 27. <laughs> <laughs> so your number was a number four. <laughs> no. My number was number five. <laughs> okay. okay. Good job. All right. So number one, I love kids. Number two, I am a visionary. And number three, I hate to travel. You said it was going to be easy, oh, Chelsea. Easy. easy. Number three is a lie. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait. I read it wrong. I read it wrong. <laughs> she <laughs> said I hate to travel. On, I read it wrong. I'm like, you don't hate kids. <laughs> yeah. Y'all know I See, love I only travel. had one sip of that wine, and I already messed up. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> Okay. Like, I know where it is. I got you. So who guessed right? Did you guess one right and then you got it right on the first try, right? Yes, yes she yes. did. Okay, so because you got it right on the first try, you get to open up the gift first. Everybody has a gift, but you get to open it up first oh. and show us what we got. Okay. For what y'all got. Over here. You want us all over or you just want either way. Y'all can go over there if you want. Y'all want okay. I'm not it's okay. 
Thank you, Kayla. Welcome. Thank you. Welcome. Thank you. Oh, oh my God. Go to the one of your top three. <laughs> What does it say? This mine tastes like I'm not going to work tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to work yeah. <laughs> Me and you were in the store when we seen those, and oh I thought it was God. really nice. Uh, okay, so now y'all can drink your wine. I need a pour in here. Yes, you guys can drink your wine the right way now. Just yeah. rinse them out. I know y'all was like, I know Kaylin got us drinking wine out of these plastic <laughs> cups over here. Like, what's, what is going on? Thank you, Welcome. Thank, Thank you, you, ladies. All right, so you guys are free to start working on your boards, okay. eat, whatever y'all want to do after that, okay? And we will catch up with you guys once we're done with our boards. I just want to hang out with the girls for a little bit, and have a little chit chat, and yeah, so let's see what these boards are going to be looking like, though. I don't know. I got a blank board. I didn't even practice yet. So we'll see. I got glue, I got scissors, all that good stuff. finished our boards they're completed here's mine and now everybody's getting ready to go bye Kendall Bye, V. <laughs> I got that sad voice on, right? I will see you guys again. <laughs> Good night, Chelsea. Good night. I will see you again. Don't forget to check out, check out all my friends, TJ and Chelsea, to become one. It'll be linked down below. Vena Supernova video. It should be already out. We're going to put it out there. It's out. It's going to be out by the time this comes out. It's out. Check it out. If it's not out, go check out the previous videos. Okay? And then, Kendall. On the way to come. <laughs> yeah. On the way to come. Y'all comment down below and say, Kendall, get a YouTube. Get a YouTube. You got a beautiful story to tell. Okay? Story. Yes, you have a beautiful story to tell. What story? What story? You and your young life and your young marriage and your um, pregnancy and your child. Okay. So the party is over. Everybody has gone home now. And I came upstairs and I... I, I was like, oh, it's time to change. Got to take out my old board and replace it with my new one. And I just, I, I don't know, I was feeling kind of sad about it. I was talking to myself and I was just like, wow, you know, this has been up here for a whole year and I really did accomplish a lot in 2018 and I'm just so thankful. I didn't do it on my own. I had lots of help um, from family and friends and I, I'm very appreciative of them coming together and helping me achieve my goals in 2018. So I'm really looking forward to 2019 and hoping to start it off with a bang. And it's so sad. I'm like, I remember looking at this literally every single day and like... Now it's done. And I was just like, oh man, I'm going to keep it though. I'm not going to get rid of this. Like, I love this. I think I want to keep each board and kind of reminisce on them each year. All right, so here's 2019's vision board. At the end of the party, the ladies and I, we sat and talked about what our uh, short-term goals were that were on our board that we wish to accomplish this year. And, you know, some of the long-term ones that we're working on. A lot of mine are short term for the most part like pretty much my whole entire board is but um our pastor asked us to ask us to pick one word each year that we're going to pray and meditate on god to help us that will you know benefit our lives in some way and my word for the year is self-discipline and i pretty much just went on the internet and kind of tried to find 
things that tied into self-discipline and there were so many things that I could have chose from. So to help make my vision board easier, I decided to um, really think about how I wanted to use this word to affect my life and in what areas that I specifically want to see difference in, a difference in. So my categories in which to apply self-discipline were mind, body, and soul. Those are the three areas in my life that I really want to be more self-disciplined in. And as far as body, like I'm not, I'm not like huge on fitness, like running and going to the gym. I mean, I'll do it, but I'm not big on it. But what I have become big on is yoga. Definitely. I have it on my planner for Monday through Friday, every single day, 10 minutes in the morning. That is my goal. This week, I didn't really do it so much because we were on vacation for some of those days. But last week, I killed it. And I'm going to put it on my vision, I mean, on my, my planner for next week as well to kill it again. Um, when it comes to the mind, I do meditation every single morning, 10 minutes a day. So I have something on here kind of representing the mind. And also, um, as far as like my inner, my inner spirit, mind, body, soul, like my soul, definitely want to remember to pray every day. And this is a great reminder for me having it right here. So let's just say the day was crazy and I'm feeling some type of way. Don't forget to pray, you know, give it up to them. Leave, let them have it. Let them handle it. And then these two right here are just little reminders of things. And, um, I'll just read this one because this one's a Bible verse. I usually pick a Bible verse each week and put it in my planner and I focus on it. But this one says, have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. Joshua 1, 9. And then I also put this one. Owning our worthiness is the act of acknowledging that we are sacred. And then down here is just a description of self-discipline. So I'm looking forward to 2019 and just challenging my inner core and just becoming more, you know, just more disciplined in these areas of my life. And I, I know I'm going to see a major difference, less stress, you know, just get rid of all that. But anyways, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I hope that you guys are conquering your goals for 2019 or at least attempting to get there so that in the future it can happen for you if it is not something that's like you know short term or anything like that but thank you guys so much and i will see you in the next video life is a day-to-day -day experience so enjoy and the one and the two and the say goodbye oh 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 say goodbye oh 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 yeah Thumbs up if you like this video and always be happy. Boom.